I'm Pauline Beck. I'm a SEIU home care worker in Alameda County. And today, Senator Barack Obama walked in my shoes. Let me see Ms. Beck here. Is this Ms. Beck? How are you? I'm Good fine. to see you. How are you? I had you breakfast home. with Senator Obama. When he came for breakfast, he just felt like he was just one of the family. You really liking that juice, huh? Yes. Man, yes. You just, you're sucking it all up. And the eggs. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> He's going to be a football player, too. You going to be a football uh, player, Dan? Yeah. I okay. met Pauline Beck, a home care worker at her home. Uh, met her wonderful family, and we drove over to John Thornton's house. Uh, he is 86 years old, a former cement mason, and uh, at his home, uh, I prepared breakfast for him. I helped to make the bed. I cleaned the house, did some laundry. I think that he's the senator doing a good job. He act like he know what he's doing anyway. He ended up like doing said, the mopping, the sweeping, and he did the laundry. <laughs> she working the hell out of it. He really wanted to do it and told me to forget that I'm the senator. Man. You know, this is All a walk in your shoes. Mm -hmm. So he said, what else she do you do? You. I, I'm ready to work, you know, so. You're ready to work, so. I, I can work while I'm talking. And ain't no standing around. So Where's I, that boom? He wanted to learn about what my needs are, what the shortcomings was, what the pitfalls was in the program, and how he can help. I learned some specific things about the struggles that uh, home care workers are going through. Uh, uh, the priority that Pauline placed on uh, having paid sick leave, uh, I think, is reminds me of how important that is to the workforce as a whole, uh, many of whom are in her position and don't have paid sick leave. You, <laughs> you all ready? Ready. Okay. There you go. SEIU has made a difference for me. They're my spokesperson. They're my voice. Well, I think it, may, I think it makes all the difference uh, to have a union representing somebody like Pauline. Uh, she described what it was like before uh, SEIU reached out to her. She was getting paid a minimum wage. She didn't have health care benefits. Uh, now, as a consequence of the work that SEIU has done, she's got uh, a wage that uh, pays uh, $10 and, and change an hour. She's got health care, but there's still more work to be done. What I do for a living is a great part of my faith. As a matter of fact, it's my faith that have me doing what I'm doing because I believe that this is my calling. I think what I was surprised uh, with was how uh, how important Pauline is to Mr. Thornton, not just because of the tasks that she does, but that she's also um, providing him a connection to the outside world, that there's somebody who he's interacting with and who cares about him. Um, you, you can't underestimate how important that is uh, to uh, somebody in, in the twilight of life. and. Uh, I think Pauline recognizes that, which is why she takes pleasure in her work. 